This is your daily UFO reminder video. We are looking at October 26 for 2024 for UFO number 12. Pop this chart up here for you to see. You will be able to get it again on the 29th of October if you're not able to capture it today. However, the 29th of October will be the last chance you get to get it. Now, if you've missed any of the previous ones, except for 4, 7, or 9, then don't worry. You can see there on the 27th of October, you will get 1, 2, and 3 again. On the 28th, you can get 5, 8, and 11. On the 29th, as we said earlier with number 12, you can also get 6 and 10 as well. But if you have missed 4, 7, or 9, you are not going to get those at all. Now, if this is the first UFO video you've seen, in order to get these, you do need to be in a lobby for over six minutes. You can be in an invite-only session if you wish, and it needs to be between 12 p.m. Sorry, between 10 p.m. and 4 a.m. in the morning. Number 12, standing behind me right here, it's going to be located above this power plant here. You might know this area. Sometimes you're sent here on missions against Merriweather and such, so you should be familiar with this area. So open up the phone, take out the camera, zoom in, take a picture and send that to Omega. And that is UFO number 12 for 2024, October 26, 2024. And again, if you do miss it today, you are able to get it again. When did I say again? It was the 29th of October. Now you might notice as well a change in my outfit today. I'm wearing the pumpkin tea. The mask here, I showed how to get this uh, two nights ago. I had a video on how to collect, uh, sorry, how to unlock the pumpkin mask, was collecting 10 jack-o'-lanterns. If you go ahead and collect all 200 in a single day, you'll get this t-shirt here. Now, considering at the time of recording this video, it has just gone on, on a new day. That is 5 p.m. Sydney time, so I don't know what time it is where you are in the world, but a new day has just started. This only took me 2 hours and 52 minutes using my trusty old friend here, the Oppressor Mark II, and using gtaweb.eu. You can mark off each pumpkin as or each jack-o'-lantern as you get it, so you know which ones you've got. Now, I have got some footage of that. I'm going to be editing that very, very shortly, and hopefully will be uploaded very soon. Uh, if you're watching this particular video later on today, that video might already be edited and uploaded. The link will be down below. So go ahead and check that one out. Uh, but look, it, it wasn't that hard. It took me 2 hours and 52 minutes. That's not really that long, is it? So it, it, it does get a bit boring after a while. But if you want this tea, that's the only way to get it. So if you've if you got the time, you can be bothered, why not? Go ahead and do it. Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. I, if you enjoyed it, please drop a like. If you want to see more GTA content, hit that subscribe button. And if you do want to see... This particular video of me with the jack-o'-lanterns. I didn't record all 200 of them, but I did get some footage of it. And if you want to see that video, uh, once that is uploaded, it'll pop up here on your end screen for you now. Otherwise, uh, yeah, check the link down below, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.